Hi everybody, so if we have the drain pipe with a diameter of 10 inches and a length of 42, 32 feet, how many feet should it drop? So the first thing we need to figure out is what slope we need um, given our pipe diameter, right? So there's different slopes recommended for different pipe diameters. Our pipe has a diameter of 10 inches, so that's 8 inches or larger, so they recommend that our slope should be um, one sixteenth of an inch per foot so that our our pipe will, will drop for every foot across it'll drop one sixteenth of an inch right Hi everybody so we've got our 10 inch diameter drain pipe and it's 32 feet long and it has a recommended slope of a drop of one sixteenth of an inch per foot so for each foot it drops down one sixteenth of an inch and we've got 32 feet right so that what that means is you know for one foot of pipe for one foot of pipe one foot it's going to drop down one sixteenth of an inch okay like that so one sixteenth of an inch right now we have 32 feet so if we go 32 so for every so that means you know if you have two feet it's going to drop down two feet of pipe. It's going to drop down, um, you know, two sixteenths or one eighth of an inch, right? So for 32 feet, it's going to be 32 drops of a sixteenth of an inch, right? Because it's 32 feet long. So we go 32 times 1 over 16, and that's 32 over 1 times 1 over 16, okay? And that works out to be 2. Okay, um, so for each foot, we drop a sixteenth of an inch. If we've got 32 feet, we're going to drop two inches. Okay, so the answer is that the pipe needs to drop two inches.